Paul Clay. The Revolution of the Viaduct. The artwork, crafted in 1937, is currently resides in the Kunsthalle in Hamburg, Germany. It stands out as one of the artist's renowned pieces, showcasing his political beliefs. This painting portrays vibrant bridge arches set against a muted grey backdrop. The arches, adorned with lively hues of yellow, red, orange, and pink, outlined in black, create a dynamic composition that appears to advance towards the observer. Diverse in shape and color, these arches appear disorganized and detached from their common base, resembling autonomous human legs in motion across the canvas. According to the artist, the intention behind this piece was to depict a revolution. The arches symbolize a rebellion against the uniformity of the bridge, serving as a metaphor for the fight against totalitarian regimes, particularly fascism, prevalent during that era. The political context of 1937 is crucial in understanding the deeper meaning of the artwork. The rise of fascism in Europe, especially in Germany, likely influenced the artist's perspective. The painting can be interpreted as a visual commentary on the imperative for individuals and artists to resist oppressive ideologies. One intriguing aspect is the metaphorical connection between the rebellious arches and artists breaking free from ideological and artistic constraints. The painting suggests that, akin to the arches resisting uniformity, artists are moving away from societal and artistic restrictions, advancing toward a form of expression that emphasizes individuality and autonomy. The composition serves as a powerful statement against totalitarianism, employing the metaphor of rebellious arches to convey the artist's call for personal and artistic freedom during a tumultuous period in history.